Meghan Markle, once celebrated as a champion for feminist ideals, has always presented herself as an advocate for women's empowerment and equality. Yet, as a new documentary series reveals, her journey from Hollywood actress to royal family member may not fully align with this image. Rather than a simple tale of ambition and charity, Meghan's past is painted with layers of controversy, ambition, and complex personal choices that suggest a more strategic and calculated side to her rise to fame. The story begins in 1981, with Meghan's birth in Los Angeles to Doria Ragland and Thomas Markle. Raised in a middle-class neighborhood, Meghan's childhood was marked by her parents' divorce when she was six, a difficult transition compounded by family tensions that would reverberate throughout her life. Determined to forge her path, Meghan attended private schools and later pursued an acting career, navigating the demanding and often ruthless world of Hollywood. Despite her private school education, Meghan faced the same harsh realities as other aspiring actors in Los Angeles. Her career path was less about glamorous roles and more about minor parts in film and television, along with numerous additions that led nowhere. But she was known among industry insiders as ambitious and even strategic in her approach. Her critics describe her early days in Hollywood as marked by a tendency to use her looks and her connections to gain entry into a world that seemed just out of reach. The stakes of these accusations grow sharper with claims that Meghan allegedly participated in yacht parties attended by wealthy men, using these connections to move up the social ladder, a reputation, though unconfirmed, that continues to stir speculation. In 2011, Meghan married Hollywood producer Trevor Engelson. Friends and family recall their relationship as initially loving, but marred by alleged difficulties and rumored infidelities. When their marriage ended in 2013, there were whispers that Meghan may have viewed the relationship as a stepping stone, aligning herself strategically with a man who could further her Hollywood career. As her career gained traction, so did her desire for independence, and she ultimately left Engelson to further her aspirations. Her role on Suits, a legal drama filmed in Toronto, marked Meghan's first real success. The role as paralegal Rachel, Zane, offered her recognition that she had long sought, yet she reportedly continued to network strategically. Critics claim she pursued connections with influential people and wealthy men, continuing a pattern of calculated decisions that would eventually set her on a path toward a much higher-profile relationship. That moment arrived in 2016, when she met Prince Harry. The couple's whirlwind romance quickly captivated the media, with their engagement announced in 2017. From the outside, it seemed like a fairy tale, an American actress and humanitarian marrying into British royalty. But insiders suggest Meghan saw the relationship with Harry as a strategic move to achieve a life of influence and status that had long eluded her. The cultural and lifestyle differences were stark. Meghan was used to Hollywood's openness and self-promotion, while the British royal family followed strict protocols and values of duty and discretion. Their marriage in 2018 was a global spectacle, but even then, cracks began to show. Meghan reportedly struggled with the demands of royal life, clashing with staff and expressing frustration with the restrictions that came with her new title. Her relationship with the royal family quickly grew strained. From difficulties with royal staff to conflicts over protocol, Meghan found the royal expectations stifling and the public's gaze relentless. Accusations of her alleged demands and resistance to guidance from royal aides suggest she had difficulty adapting to the traditional structure of the monarchy. This tension reached a breaking point with her and Harry's decision to step back from their royal duties in 2020, a decision that shocked the world and shifted public perception. The move, branded as Megxit, divided public opinion, casting her as both a figure of independence and controversy. The series offers a critical reevaluation of Meghan's public persona. It explores the path from her Hollywood years to her role as a royal and ultimately her decision to leave that life behind. Her self styled image as a feminist and humanitarian now stands in stark contrast to allegations of strategic relationships calculated career moves, and a disregard for the traditional values of the royal family. As the documentary concludes, viewers are left with a complex portrait of a woman who defied convention and pursued her ambitions, 
even as her choices brought her both fame and intense scrutiny. The series raises compelling questions about authenticity, ambition, and the price of fame, challenging the narrative Megan has carefully constructed over the years.